Hi friends, it's Miss Brown. Hope everyone's safe and well. I just wanted to read a special story today for Mother's Day because Sunday we will be celebrating all those special mommies out there. So the story I'll be reading today is T-Rex and the Mother's Day Huck. And the author is Lois Street Grambling. And remember, the author writes the words. Illustrated by Jack E. Davis. The illustrator draws all the pictures. All right, let's start. A note was taped to T-Rex refrigerator and it read, Remember Mother's Day. T-Rex's doorbell rang. It was his friends, Diplodocus, Stegosaurus, and Iguandan. Each had a package. Mother's Day gifts? T-Rex asked. You bet, Diplodocus said. Are you doing something for your mother again this year? Instead of getting her something, Stegosaurus asked. T-Rex nodded. What are you doing, Iguanda asked. I haven't decided, T-Rex said. Better decide soon. Mother's Day is tomorrow. Diplodocus said, call if you need any help. And Stegosaurus said, I will, T-Rex. Thanks. The next morning, T-Rex rushed downstairs to see his mother. Happy Mother's Day, Mama, he said. I want to do something for you today, something that will make you happy. And Mama Rex smiled. A Mother's Day hug would make me happy, dear, she said. I want to do more, Mama, T-Rex said. More! Maybe I can go to Dinosaur Swamp and pick some ferns and decorate the living room for you today. But then T-Rex remembered he and his friends had done this before. And that had not made Mama happy. Mama remembered too. How could she forget? The living room had turned into a rainforest. Muddy footprints and murky puddles were everywhere. What a mess! Mama Rex's brow folded into rows of wrinkles. A Mother's Day hug would make me happy, dear, she said. I want to do more, Mama, T-Rex said. More! Maybe I can wallpaper the dining room for you today and make the dining room brighter. Oh, but then T-Rex remembered he and his friends had done this before and that had not made Mama happy. Mama remembered too. How could she forget? T-Rex and his friends had paper over the windows and over Great Aunt Bertha. The dining room was dark now, and Great Aunt Bertha was just a bulge on one wall. What a mess! Mama Rex's brow folded into big rows of wrinkles. A Mother's Day hug would make me very happy, dear, she said. Oh, but I want to do more, said T-Rex. What could he do for Mama today? He looked out the window and saw Mama's car. Mama Rex went into the kitchen, made herself a cup of tea, sat down, waited, and worried. Oh boy. T-Rex called Diplodocus, Stegosaurus, and Iguandan. They came right over and the four friends started doing things to Mama's car. Diplodocus painted a frowning T-Rex on the grill. Stegosaurus painted racing stripes on both sides. Iguandan hammered a shiny ornament on the hood. And T-Rex and T-Rex pasted ferns here and there and everywhere. And when there was absolutely no more they could do, T-Rex added a sign on the side that read, Mama's Rexmobile. And T-Rex stepped back and admired Mama's Rexmobile. Diplodocus, Stegosaurus, and Iguandan stepped back and decided to leave before Mama Rex saw it. T-Rex called to his mama, Come out now, Mama! Mama Rex hurried out and gasped. That's my car, she asked. How, hoping it wasn't, T-Rex 
grinned. Now you won't have trouble finding your car when you park it at the mall, Mama, he said. But Mama's brow folded into bigger rows of wrinkles. I'm sure I won't, dear, she said. <laughs> Happy Mother's Day, Mama, T-Rex said, giving Mama a very big hug. And suddenly, all of Mama's rows of wrinkles disappeared, and a very big smile spread across her face. That Mother's Day hug made me very happy, dear, she said, and that's what I wanted most for Mother's Day. I love you so much, Mama, T-Rex said. I know, dear. I love you so much, too. Even though Mama Rex loved T-Rex so much, she was so happy. Mother's Day came only once a year. Happy Mother's Day, Mama Rex. And that's the end. And so it wasn't just all of the fancy things that Mama T-Rex wanted for Mother's Day. All she wanted was a hug. So make sure you give your mommy a big hug and show her how much you love her on her special day. I hope you guys enjoyed the story. Bye.